Hi, as in the previous video, you have just seen how to set up the environment for the React implementation. Now we are going to work with the Node Package Manager in order to set up the React environment. This is the method which most of the user prefer, I also prefer and in this particular video series, we will be following this pattern itself. So let's get started with the NPM environment setup for React.js. So for setting up the environment using NPM, first of all, I'll have to install the Node.js from its official website that is Node.js.org. So here, depends on the latest version available, I'll just download that. And as soon as it will be done, I will execute it for the installation. As now you can see, I have executed the setup file and it's a very simple straightforward wizard. I'll just say next every time it's asked me and finally I will click on install. And this is how your installation will begin and will be completed. Once it is done, we will open the command prompt and will start working with the node package manager. So now as node is successfully installed, what I will do, I will come to the E drive where I want to create a project and here I have already created a project called tp underscore react demo and inside that I would like to create my application. So first of all what I will have to do is I will have to install a package here using npm install command and I will install that globally. So for that I will say hyphen g alright. And the name of the package is create react app. So create hyphen react hyphen app. As soon as I'll click enter, it will start getting installed. And as you can see, it is now installed. So what I can do in now, I will just use this particular package again and will give the name of my application. All right, like this is the directory inside which I want to create my application. So let's say the name of my application is my app all right so using this particular package i'm going to create my application so it will carry all the scaffolding all the required files which i want to create my application so let's say enter and it will take a couple of minutes to get installed and once it is done your application is ready to begin so now after a couple of minutes as you can see it is successfully installed and it has created an application with the name my app. So what we'll have to do for execution as it is saying that since I have created with the name my app first I'll have to go inside that directory that is my app and after that I will have to say npm start. So as soon as I'll enter that it will start the server on the port 3000 by default and it will execute my application as here you can see in the browser you can see there is an output now and to start we'll have to edit the file app.js alright so let's go to that location and inside here my app you can see there is src and right there you can see app.js so let me just open this and here you can see everything like whatever I'm getting there in the output I'm getting all from here itself alright so basically it has its own CSS files like index.css app.css and a couple of JS files like index.js and app.js and finally they are returning us the template which is basically getting loaded in this public folder index.html Alright, so this is how your application is running. We will see how the complete execution is taking place in a great detail in our coming videos. Tutorialspoint.com Simply easy learning.